Welcome to Kaizen Institute's 3C Problem Solving video. The 3C Problem Solving is a framework or a method of resolving simple day-to-day -day issues or problems into effective and result-oriented solutions. This method makes continuous improvement accessible to everyone and helps you to keep track of the changes. The three C's are concern, cause and countermeasure. The concern relates to the identification of the problem. You have to walk to the place where the problem is arising, observe and recognize the problem. Correctly assessing a problem is possible only by direct observation. We have to look for potential wastages, identify and remove them. The waste adds unnecessary time and cost to a process. Removal of the non-value adding activity is the primary goal. The cause refers to the analysis of causes or situation based on your actual observation. The 5Y technique is extremely effective to drill down to the root cause of a problem. Unless we get to the root cause using the 5Y technique, we cannot propose or implement an effective countermeasure. The Ishikawa or the fishbone diagram identifies many possible causes for a problem. The Ishikawa diagram combines brainstorming with mind mapping and lets you consider all possible causes of a problem rather than the most obvious reason. Countermeasure refers to the proposing and selecting a solution. You have to brainstorm, predict, forecast and use project planning skills to set up a realistic deadline. The final step to resolve the problem may take some time. In such a case, do not try to aim for a perfect solution immediately. You may have to use or implement other countermeasures before the final countermeasure can be implemented to achieve the desired outcome. Action plan and progress tracking is important to check the effect of the countermeasures. The problem solving tool is a 3C sheet that can be divided into four steps. Describe the problem or concern, analyze root causes or cause, design and test solution or countermeasure, and check results. Start by listing the concern or the problem. This may relate directly to the current issue or any ongoing issue at your workplace. The concern column describes the problem and answers the questions what is the problem? Why is the problem arising? What are the consequences of the problem? Under the cause column, you describe the probable reason for the problem. The cause column should describe the cause analysis with technical proofs. The countermeasure column incorporates designing and testing of solutions. Put down the solution which may fix the problem Invite others to collaborate and put down the potential solutions in the countermeasure column. The countermeasure section involves improvement ideas, idea assessments, PDCA definition and implementation. The check results column comprises of comparing the current and initial conditions and documenting the improvement. The check results section also covers solution yield results and the goals achieved. Once the countermeasure has been selected from among all suggested ideas and implemented, you have to keep checking the results. The checking of results can be done by the whole team or an individual. A person from a team can be selected as the problem owner who keeps track of the results. Select a realistic due date to close the documented problem. The progress for the countermeasure has to be documented. The progress can also be indicated symbolically for quick reference. Update the 3C document regularly so that it reflects the latest condition of the problem. This 3C technique will allow everyone in your team to recognize or identify the problems, document them properly, and think of the best solutions and implement them. The 3C tool will also help the team to keep track of the progress and close the issue or the problem before the due date or deadline. For more information, 
get in touch with the learning and development team of the Kaizen Institute.